In this Canva tutorial, let's take a look at two ways to highlight text in Canva. So there's, there's two ways. Number one, you can just customize, put a shape behind certain text. Number two, if you have or want all the text within a text box to be highlighted, you can uh, add a background. So let's take a look at this product sales text right here. So unfortunately, this way, you can't just highlight words and do it. But if you had a couple words that are on their own and you want to give them a background, you can select that text box or select the words and then go to effects. And in effects, we have background. And so we can actually give this text a background. We can adjust the roundness, the spread of the outline or the highlight, I should say, the transparency of the highlight. And then of course the color. So you can change the color as well. So this would highlight or give a background around all the text I wish you could just highlight certain words and do this, but it does it to the whole uh, text box. If you want to just highlight certain words, let's say I just wanted to highlight something like uh, just these couple of words right here, right? What I would have to do is add an actual shape. So I would go to elements, I would go find uh, shapes. So you should have a category right here. If not, you could search for things like rectangle. You could search for things like rounded rectangle even. And when you do that, you can find shapes. And if you go see all on the category, you have a lot of different options here. There is a rounded square option right here, which we could click and drag out. And what we'll have to do with this guy is scale him uh, down or size him down a lot and just kind of get him to fit this area of where we want to highlight. So we use all the handles in the corners. We can zoom in and out with command and control plus and minus, uh, or using the slider down here. And once we get in here, we want to select that uh, shape. And if it's behind your text, you can click and drag to select both and then press shift to deselect the text. So now we have the shape again. So we're in here, we're kind of trying to tweak this shape a little bit. And once we get it to where we want, we can change the color of it up here to, let's say that highlighter yellow. And we've got that in there. So we've highlighted a piece of text by basically putting a shape behind the text. If your shape isn't behind the text, just select the text or the shape, right click and select, not align to page, but you should be in layer. You can send to back or bring to front. Uh, you can also show the layers to kind of see all the different layers here. We see that we have the highlight right there. We have the text up here. We could click on it just to select it from here in our layers panel. We could also click and drag to bring those layers up. So now it's in front of the text, which of course doesn't work, but we can bring this below the text and it essentially highlights it. You could put it in front of the text and change the transparency. Although I don't really like that as much because I feel like it affects the text too much. I would rather just put it behind the text and have that piece highlighted. So you can choose whatever shape you want. In this case, it was just, it ended up being like a rounded rectangle that once it was this small, it's like a pill shape, but you could do like sharp corners or anything like that to create highlights here. So you can highlight entire text boxes of words or individuals just by adding in shapes. And that's how you can highlight here in Canva.